What's up, badass nerds? Is pumpkin spice all that nice? What's up, peeps? This is not a Dunkin' Donuts video, although... It's not sponsored by them either. It's not ever gonna end. Uh, but this is gonna be part of, uh, the thing. This of. one. Not this one. Yeah. It, uh, all right, let me just explain. I, I got a bunch of new pumpkin spice products because, you know, every year they come out with eight gazillion of them. I got the ones that I could get my hands on. Some of them were too hard to get unless you want to pay $15 for a box of fucking cereal. Black which market price. I will not do. So I got the ones that I could get my hands on. I did pay an outrageous price for one of them, which we'll get to later. And I am going to be giving something away, which is just what? a super weird thing. A prize? Yeah. It's like a weird thing to give away, and it's probably going to cost Sweet. a lot to shift. You guys are lucky. But, um, yeah. So. We've never done a prize before. Um. So, here's the thing. I like the juice. I've never had, <laughs> um, pumpkin spice anything before like to my knowledge and to my memory if my memory serves me I've never had pumpkin spice flavored anything and I've never had pumpkin pie so I don't know what like the spices are supposed to be anyway because <laughs> some of these things are pumpkin pie flavored which in turn would be pumpkin spice anyway because pumpkin spice is the spices that they put into pumpkin pie. Pumpkin spice does not mean that there's pumpkin in it, but all pumpkin pie flavored things have pumpkin spice in it. If you're following me, if not, I'm not either, so it's okay. Uh, so I got here uh, pumpkin spice uh, ice latte with almond milk because dairy does weird things to me sometimes. So. so this will be my first taste of pumpkin spice anything. Is this pumpkin or pumpkin spice? It's pumpkin. Pumpkin swirl. Swirl. Uh, Dunkin' Donuts doesn't do pumpkin spice? That's what their pumpkin is. Well this is pumpkin. <laughs> And in turn, probably pumpkin spice too. I don't know. I don't know. Espresso is a very strong flavor, so it covers up a lot. But I do get a little like taste of like cinnamon, maybe like nutmeg too, something. But it's very subtle. I was hoping I wouldn't hate this because I really wanted a lot to hate it. Let me try. <sighs> I'm not really a huge pumpkin person. I love, I love pumpkin pie. And pumpkin cookies and pumpkin donuts. Sounds like you're really <laughs> a big pumpkin person. <laughs> but I've never had a pumpkin drink. Me either until right this second. It doesn't look like you hate it. I don't. Um, let's start. Okay. 
So our first item up for grab is uh, a pumpkin to buy a papa dog. Well, it's not up for grabs. Don't. don't All right, don't say it. I misspoke. <laughs> it's a peanut butter. How you say pop tart? No, pumpkin pie. Pop tart. Yeah. Pop tart. Pop tart. It's not peanut pop, butter. Pop, pop, pop. How do you say pop? It's a... Pop, 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 pop. <laughs> How much caffeine have you had today? A little bit. <laughs> so, yeah. Pumpkin pie pop tarts. Frosted. Uh, these are new, apparently. And look. Delish. I'm gonna be disappointed if they're not. I'm probably gonna be disappointed. If they are. <laughs> just, <laughs> just regardless. Uh, oh, key, that okay. key. Why do you always give me the broken shit? I don't know. <laughs> I think you do. <laughs> It's not the most heinous thing I've ever eaten. But like... I don't know. Mm, I don't know what I it. It's not the worst thing I've ever had, but it's not something I'm going out of my way to have. I've never had pumpkin pie before, so I don't know. Does this taste like pumpkin pie? No. You have not had pie until you bought my mama's pumpkin pie. <laughs> Does she take pumpkin from a can and no, she makes it crust? from scratch. My mama ain't no box, baby. <laughs> <laughs> Are we rating these? Chewbacca. Actually, the more I eat it, the more you like it. The more I don't hate it. It's like Stockholm syndrome. <laughs> <clears throat> I don't really care for it. So one being not nice, ten being twice as nice. What would you give it? Uh, a two. Do you notice that the The outside of it actually tastes like pie crust. Mm hmm Tastes different than a regular Pop-Tart. Yeah, it's less sweet. Mm hmm That's actually a nice touch. I think I'd give it like a... Surprisingly, I think I'd give it like a six. I never eat pumpkin things because I'm afraid I'm not gonna like it, but I'm like this isn't bad at all. It's very good. This is pumpkin pie rice, rice crispy treats. Oh my god, people, rice crispy treat pumpkin pie. Let's see what the el these elves made. That crackle and cheese. Ooh. It smells good. It has a very potent smell. Mmm. Oh, I can actually see like the spice in this. Mm-hmm. Not really pumpkin pumpkin flavor. It's kind of like they tried to get pumpkin but didn't really succeed with it. There's actually dried pumpkin in here. Hmm. I mean it doesn't really taste like pumpkin. 
It kind of does, like a hint of pumpkin, but not really. Mm. Mm -hmm. It's not bad though. Yeah, it's subtle. Do they put allspice in the pumpkin pie? Um, really cinnamon and nutmeg are the main ingredients. It's not bad. It's not really overpoweringly pumpkin. It's very mm. subtle. That's why I like it though. I'll probably give it a four. I'm trying to determine whether I like it more or less than the Pop Tarts. I like it way more than the Pop Tarts. You like it two more than the Pop Tarts. Way more. I guess it's like the... Uh, or it could be tied for one less. It's not super good, it's not super bad. You know, it's like five. It's like a five. Okay. Okay. I think I just like food more than you. What's next, Lucifer? Uh, the devil just came out of me. Mm. Everything that I got was from a list that I looked up. I was like, what are the, I looked up like, what are the new pumpkin spice items or food items, whatever. Well, obviously it would be food. No. <laughs> what are the new pumpkin spice items for 2019? And I, they gave me a list of like 23 things. And obviously I didn't get them all, and I wasn't gonna try to get them all, but some of them I really wanted to get. They were... They are on your bucket list. Some things that I wanted to get, but didn't include. Um, pumpkin Spice Cheerios. Pumpkin Spice Special K Cereal. Pumpkin Spice Frosted Shredded Mini Meats. And Pumpkin Spice Blue Diamond Almonds. I didn't want to pay. Yeah. I didn't want to pay sixteen dollars for two boxes of cereal on Amazon. Sixteen dual pass. So Hannaford didn't have anything except for the Rice Krispie treats and these, which weren't on the list. But these are limited edition. Also, they're the I love Werther's original. Werther's original pumpkin spice soft caramels. I don't know about adding pumpkin spice to them, but we'll see. They also make a caramel apple one. That is. Say it isn't so. That is. Say it isn't so. They're really good. Are they? So good. Yeah, I have them. Can we try them? So maybe I will. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna find out what her house is later. I'm thinking it's a Slytherin <laughs> from the way she's speaking. Werther's <laughs> 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 Originals. This was my favorite candy growing up with my grandfather. The hard ones. And now they've added flavoring to them. The ones you had grown up with your grandpa were, were the, the hard original ones. original hard candies with my grandpa. It smells like it's gonna be not as sweet. You know when you can like smell sugar in something? Mm -hmm. I know caramels are like all sugar, but it doesn't smell sweet. You can taste pumpkin. I at was all. just gonna say. All I can taste is caramel. It, like the slightest hint. Like maybe when I first started, but all I can taste is caramel. Caramel's way overpowering. There's a very, very slight hint of something else, like the nutmeg, I think. Mm -hmm. 
The nutmeg hits hard in a lot of them. Yeah. Well, that's a really powerful ingredient in it. So you know if you eat enough nut nutmeg, it makes you trip balls. I do not. I do not. I learned that from Orange is the New Black. Don't you know? Don't it's like season two or three. Something bad. Morning star was. We're getting way off track. <laughs> <laughs> so, <sighs> been there for. Um, Caramels is very slight. You get like a little bit of nutmeg. You don't really yeah. taste. I don't taste any cinnamon. I could taste like very, very faint some kind of spice, but like really, all I could taste was caramel. So, I mean, it just tasted like a Werther's original caramel chew to me. It really didn't scream pumpkin spice or anything. Yeah, but... I don't know how to rate it, because it wasn't terrible, but right, that's I couldn't thinking. really judge it based on pumpkin spice, because I really couldn't taste pumpkin spice. I guess I'd give it a five, because it's not really... Like, this is supposed to be pumpkin spice stuff, so it it didn't really taste all that much like pumpkin spice, but it wasn't bad, so mm -hmm. I guess I'll just go in the middle there. Which, I feel like guilty giving it the same score I gave the Rice Krispie Treats, because obviously it's so much better, but like not on a pumpkin spice scale. Yeah. I don't, it's, I would give it, it's confusing. I would probably give it the same score. Just because it was good, but it wasn't pumpkin spice rated good. So it's kind of hard to give it a score, but I guess I'll give it a 5 just because it's the best thing I've had so far, but, but not, not pumpkin wise. Yeah. If that makes sense. Yeah. Okay, Google. What are. The spices in pumpkin pie. Beach, I didn't ask for recipes. Well, a recipe's gonna tell you what's in pumpkin pie. Pumpkin pie. Fine. I'm just saying. Are you? It says that there's cinnamon, ginger, nutmeg, allspice, which is what I said before. Let's put a playback of me asking you, and you say, Oh, yeah, that's what I said. I don't know. Okay? And then ground cloves. Yeah, cloves is the powerful taste that you're tasting. Cloves are very potent. So between that, the allspice, and the nutmeg, those are three very powerful tastes. So is cinnamon and ginger though. Like ginger is too. Pumpkin yeah. pie spice, like all of all, all of their ingredients are very distinct tastes. They're all very powerful spices. Mm -hmm. So this is the one that I'm most excited about that I got anyway. I really wanted to try the frosted mayonnaise and the Cheerios, but I'm glad that I at least got one. Cheerios, maybe. Frost them anyways, I can't see being good. I'm glad that I got at least one of the pumpkin spice cereals. And this is just Tell pumpkin what spice. what it is! What cereal? Life. Pumpkin spice. Blood. Okay. Now the it's people, the pumpkin now, spice of life. Now the people know. Okay. So. Gotta keep them in the loop. Okay. I'm more excited about this than the other one because I love cereal. I know you do. I know you do. Oh my god! One. Oh no. Quam. 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 You have a qualm no. with me? <laughs> you have. <laughs> Speak your truth, Peach. <laughs> I say that to other people and they're boring. I said that to you, you make it hilarious. 
Everybody else is like, what's, what the hell is a qualm? I feel like she's trying to communicate, but I'm not sure what she's trying to say. I feel like it's kind of trying to communicate with me. <laughs> oh, it smells like life. Now, life already has cinnamon in it. I can't say that I've ever had life cereal. Actually, they make a cinnamon life. I don't, I think regular life has like a tiny bit of cinnamon in it. I've never had it. You know, life cereal is no. so good. No. My favorite cereal growing up was was Kex. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I loved Kex. That was what my parents got us because it was, was cheap. Legit. It was cheap and also like it was delicious. Okay. Also, like there was not much sugar in it, but when we got the berry berry cakes, we were like. On top of the fucking world. That was our oh, jam. Huh. The spices really come through in something. The spices are overpowering. It's like, I don't want to say that life cereal is bland, but like, Cereal in general is like a vehicle for flavor. <laughs> I've never heard it described that way before. <laughs> I am uh, not a fan. I think it is way too powerful. I honestly don't mind it. I do not. I don't like overpowering seasoning. I'm very particular. No, not you. I like what I like. I just don't like really powerful spices. The more I eat, the less powerful it seems. Cause your tongue's numb. <laughs> Every few bites you get like hit in the back of the throat looks like something real strong. That's delicious. <laughs> I don't hate it. I love, I just love cereal though. Like, like, remember when we did a cereal taste test and you were given things like negatives mm -hmm. and mine was always like, Five or above because it's I was like I'd still eat it I'm like <laughs> ah. the more you eat it also like you get immune to it but then it comes back with like a vengeance I'll be back it's not terrible by any means but it's not like something I'd go out of my way to get. I again. would give it a zero. Why do you hate everything? <laughs> you get a four. Very generous. <laughs> I like cereal. So you said already. <laughs> Can you do the wall? You don't do the wall. You seizing? <laughs> so this is pumpkin spice panel butter beach. Okay, so we can see exactly what's Whoa. in this. Why is this so runny? You gotta stir it. It's this is one of the more natural peanut butters that you have to stir. So it's peanuts, cane sugar, palm oil, cinnamon, ginger, pumpkin, salt, nutmeg, allspice. And less of them. Less of what? Oh shit, we need to fight. But they don't have cloves in it, but they do have actual oh, pumpkin in it. Smells it smells terrible. Let me smell. <laughs> I mean, does it not? <laughs> I get an overwhelming smell of peanuts. Honestly. I get an overwhelming smell of nauseousness. This has actual pumpkin in it. 
It's graphic. <laughs> Just trying to get it stirred. Really? Uh, it's dripping. Well, time it, take it. I don't give me that much. <laughs> the hell? It's dripping Quick. again. Quick. It's Quick. Pushed it in the back of my throat. That's what she said. <laughs> oh, this is not good. Oh, this is not good. This is bad. This is real bad. As soon as the peanut goes away, there's just a bunch of like spices without any kind of sugar or sweetener just left in your mouth and it just sticks there. <laughs> I feel like I just did the cinnamon challenge. <laughs> like, <laughs> what the fuck is happening? <laughs> Did you just like throw up or something? I'm good. <laughs> what the fuck just happened? throw up a little? <laughs> um, I, I would give that a negative 20. Really? Yes. I would give it a 1, a 2 at the very most. It's like, <sighs> you can see it and it's so runny and you can see all the spices in it. Like, there's too much spice in it. They didn't distribute it enough. I concur. <laughs> no, thank you. Now this next thing is what I am giving away because I can only get it by buying two from a Walmart website. So I'll be giving one of these away. Uh, you're like, what is it? Well, this is Riley's Organic 100% Human Grade Pumpkin and Coconut Dog Treats. And yeah, that's right. Like, you heard it right. Dog treats. Probably like, Danielle, why are you eating dog why treats? Why on earth did you buy dog treats? First of all, they're human grade, Beach. Second of all, they're vegan. So really, what could be in them that's so awfully terrible? And it's got all the- You have to ask that question? This is more just pumpkin flavored than anything. Uh, but- Oh, pumpkin and coconut. It was on the list. The only coconut thing in here is coconut oil. I know, but the cover says peanut butter and coconut. Okay. They probably had to put coconut on it because they used coconut oil to bind yeah, it. Yeah, because what if your dog has a severe coconut allergy? Then you should read the fucking labels if your dog's that severely allergic to something. Wow. Okay. Wow. Wow. So we're gonna try this and tell you whether or not it's okay for your dog because we're smarter than them. Um, barely. <laughs> and then I'm gonna give this one away, and Kayla's gonna figure out who gets it. And, meaning she's gonna tell you how to get it or whatever. Ugh. It smells super normal. Super normal dog treat! It smells like peanuts because there's peanut flour in it. You smell a peanut? Mm-hmm. I don't really smell pumpkin. I just smell peanuts. What are they? 
This doesn't taste like pumpkin or coconut. This one tastes like anything. It's just really super dry. And it tastes like nothing. I get a tiny, tiny hint of peanut. That's it. I got nothing. Those poor dogs that you force into eating in some dogs. I'll give that a one. Because it's not terrible, but it doesn't taste like anything. I'm going to give that a zero. Made for your dog to eat, not for you, even though you may want to once <laughs> you smell it. Lies! <laughs> zero it seems <clears throat> unfair. It was uh, a lot of work. How Very bland. Zero too. Um, so this one we're giving away. So what I want you to do is first one to write in the comments their favorite part of the video and what your dog's name is. We'll give this to you. Favorite part of the video, when it ended. <laughs> <laughs> hey, if that's your favorite part, then that's your favorite part. And you'll get a free bag of dog treats. Let us know. Yeah, and once you do that, then I'll uh, send you my email address and you can send me your address and I will send it to you and you can give it to your dog and then your dog can be like fuck you beach it's like shit <laughs> them human. and I'll be like I told you so I told you on the video it tasted like nothing and me and your dog can be friends and I'm gonna take it to but, the park obviously well I would eat the dog treats over the peanut butter <laughs> I kind of would too, honestly. Like seriously. Like as like, soon as I smelled the peanut butter, I got nauseous. Like, well, I hope you enjoyed our video. Uh, like this video if you like you guys, spice, or if you don't, still like it. I don't care. If you guys have any suggestions of other taste test videos we can do, uh, we're down for anything. Well, I am. Unless it has onions. Listen, it. I try to do a dog treat. Okay. Yes, ma'am. Comment below all the things that we did wrong, because I'm sure there were lots. Yes, we got sidetracked a lot. So, like and subscribe and hit the bell so you can be notified every time I post. Bing! Uh, keep, keep being badass. Keep being nerdy. Much, Much love, love and peace, peace out, y'all.